Hey guys, welcome back to the Luke Roo channel. We're here in Sedona, Arizona. We just left Overland Expo in Flagstaff, spent the night on top of Schneebly Hill, and we're making our descent down now. We're also gonna check out Broken Arrow. We're also going to check out Soldier's Pass. So if you're interested, stay tuned. I checked the reviews on Onyx just before we left, and they ranked it a 3 out of 10, so I knew it was going to be nothing hard, but uh, they said it was bumpy as hell, and they were so right. But I was super stoked because I just took off the Terraflex 9550 shocks that were on my Jeep. Those things were completely trashed. I threw on the Fox 2.0 Reservoir shocks, a vast improvement. It handled this washboard so well. It was really smooth, I had total control, and I'm really happy with them. So we descended down into Sedona with beautiful scenery to the left and on our everywhere all around us. And we headed towards Broken Arrow. We were out there with our friends Don and Sochi in their Tacoma, and that truck can definitely take you places. I was really impressed. It handled Broken Arrow like a breeze. Yeah, we had a few scratches on the skid plate, but guess what? That's what they were there for. It was really nice being back by Broken Arrow. It was one of the first trails that I ever did in the Jeep, and I really got to experience what it was like to just drive a stock Jeep and how capable it actually was you know, from the factory. And so to have all my upgrades on it and to go back to the trail, it was really, really exciting. And I think the Jeep did fantastically. Obviously there's more to come, but for the time being, I was pretty happy.
Devil's Staircase can definitely be a little scary the first time you go down it. The first time that I went down it, me and my girlfriend were absolutely losing it. She had to get out of the car because it's just so steep and the camera doesn't do it justice. That's gonna be the end of the video. I didn't get any footage of Soldier's Pass because I'm the worst and the drone was still broken even though I thought I fixed it. So I ran out of footage guys, but thank you so much for watching and stay tuned for more.